What's shaking, everybody? Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you want to learn how to do a cut crease, different ways of doing a cut crease, you better stay tuned because this bitch is going to show you how. All right, let me go get some eyeshadow on and we will get this party started. All right, that bitch is back. So, this is what I have so far. Do not mind my eyebrows. They are not done yet. I need to carve them out and do all that fun stuff. But I always do that at the end. So, now that I have all of this on, I hope you guys like it, um, I am going to show you different ways to do a cut crease. The first hack that we're going to do today, we're going to use the eyelash curler with the concealer, okay? We all learned this in 2021, and it freaking works. So we're going to do that one first. So I got my eyelash curler and I got my concealer. All right. I got my concealer on the end of my eyelash curler. Let's get it on. All right. I hope this doesn't fuck it up. Okay. All right. It didn't go all the way down, but that's okay. Right, so it works and I'm just gonna take a small brush and I'm gonna dip it into my concealer and I'm just gonna tighten up that line It'll be very do light light feather strokes and there we go and then you can fill it in if you want we'll fill it in for now now the only reason why I don't like doing it this way personally um, put, is because I like to take the color completely off, covering it up with an eye primer or a concealer. It's all fine and dandy, but whatever color you have underneath is going to mix in that, and so whatever color you put on top, it's not going to be the same. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. Next one, I'm going to go on this eye, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of concealer, put it on my lash line, look up. Let's put a little bit more here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and now we can see where it is. So we're just going to do the exact same thing we did to this side with our small brush and just kind of carve it out. All right, guys, I got my Vaseline on my pan. I got my angle brush. Let's take all this off and start from fresh. I like doing it this way because I don't want any of the color I have underneath of my concealer or my eye primer to mix in because I want to have a fresh, clean slate for all the pigment of the color that I'm going to be putting on top to be perfect. All right, I got my angle brush full of Vaseline and I'm just going to follow where I made that line with the concealer and fill it in where all that concealer was. I'm going to take my Q-tip and I am just going to clean it off. And it's okay if you touch the other colors above. It will not come off if you do not have Vaseline on it. And we're going to clean it all off and have a clean slate. Sorry, I like to pull my eye back. <laughs> and there we go. We have a clean slate. All right, now time for my primer. I like to use Anastasia Beverly Hills. If you watch any of my stuff, you'll see that I use it all the time because I love it. It is freaking awesome. It is really great for blending. You can use whatever primer you want. I just got my brush and it has a really fine tip on it. So I am just going to go in and follow that line, but be very careful. and then fill it in. Okay, here I got this side all filled in, all good to go. So I'm gonna go finish off this look and I'm gonna show you guys the end freaking result. All right, the bitch is back and I am so freaking happy with the way this turned out. Like, look at that. Now, I really hope what I've shown you today can really help you to do a cut crease yourself at home. And you know, it's all just makeup. It comes off, just practice, man. You know how long it took me to do a cut crease and I'm a makeup artist, like I went to school. And honestly, it took me so long to really get it. Practice, practice, practice. That is my only advice that I give all the time is just freaking practice, man. And if you're not happy with it, just try again. You know how many times there is a look that I have in my head that I want to do and I have to, it doesn't come out and I just have to take it off and keep freaking trying. Like makeup, it comes off, right? I mean, yeah, it's a piss off, but 
I can try. You gotta try. All right, guys, until next time, I hope you have a great day. Bye.